What's the guys asked by back another player review? And it is moments Ferran Jutkla. Jutkla? We'll go with Jutkla. I am uh, very bad at pronouncing. Um, not the most common name, let's be honest. Jutkla. Um, and it's a very random card, let's be honest. He is an 87 rated moments Spanish striker who plays for Club Bruges in Belgium. Why we've got this card, I don't know. But I like these kind of cards. They're different. Not a card. Let's face it, no one would have ever used Jutler unless you're a Belgium League fan or packed him and you're doing an RTG uh, right at start FIFA. But 87 rated, he's 5 foot 9, high medium work rates, right footed, 4 star skill moves and a 4 star weak foot. And looking at foot bin, his SBC costs 19k. It's literally an 83 rated squad with a Spanish player and a team of the week. Pretty much a bargain to be honest. It's great fodder as well. Um, 87, if we do want to do him for an SBC, 19k, it's cheaper than buying an 87 on the market. He could play centre forward or left wing. And obviously he starts off in striker, so that's where we will be playing him. And I've put a hunter card on him. Stats wise, 87 pace. He's got 9 acceleration, 85 sprint speed. So pretty decent pace. Shooting, 89 tackle positioning, 91 finishing, 85 shot power, 90 long shots, and 84 volleys. So it looks like he's got pace and he can finish. That's always important for a striker. Passing, 84 vision, 84 crossing, 90 short passing, 84 curve. Decent passing there. And then dribbling as well, 87 agility, 89 balance, 81 reactions, 90 ball control, 87 dribbling, and 81 composure. So you can dribble, finish, and got pace. And he's pretty strong, 80 strength with 82 stamina. 78 jumping and 77 heading. So basically, he's got all the attributes needed for a striker. Um, he's got a finesse shot and outside the foot shot traits. So if this was in the Premier League, I'd think it's a very good card. Or like other card, a good league basically is what I'm trying to say. Um, it might be quite difficult to link him. Um, for example, in my team, I'm having to put Mignolet in goal um, on two chem, which I will be subbing when I get into the game uh, to actually get him on chemistry. But like I say, we're getting a few games. I enjoy using these kind of cards just because they're different. I would never ever choose to use them normally. Um, so yeah, getting a few games. We will follow. Hopefully, he is fun. So, Ferran Juggler Moments card is the exact reason why I love doing these SBCs. Using players I don't normally use, because he's fantastic in game. Two games, five goals, and boy can he finish. He's got very, very good pace, um, agility, and his dribbling. He's very hard to tackle when you're getting like one-on-one -on -one with the keeper, or you're doing them sh RB dribbling where they keep the ball close to you. Um, you can win free penalties, he won a penalty for me, he scored it. Uh, he won plenty of free kicks. His player traits, finesse shot and out to the foot shot. He scored some screamers for me. Two of his goals were fantastic. Long shot, finesse shot, and long shot outside the foot shot. Um, and so overall, a very, very fun card to use. I really, really enjoy these cards, like I said before. If you're looking for a fun player who feels more than 87, um, and just you need 
a different feel to the team and you just want to have a little bit of fun in division rivals i'd try him out because he is a very very good card obviously if you're like a proper sweat and you you don't like trying new cards obviously this isn't the guy for you but if you like me like using different players on the game he is a fantastic card to use and for 19k even if you don't really like him he's great fodder for sbcs um and yeah definitely definitely recommend doing it it's like a Probably one of my favourite non-big player SPCs that's come out. Um, yeah. Yeah. Nothing more really to say about him. Very fun card.